So check out this dock. We're on the Avon docks here. And you can see that the guys are really busy this morning. Beautiful plants shipping out. Landscapers are finishing up jobs, stocking up garden centers. Nice time to plant. Let's take a walk through the dock. So we can see here, new gen freedom. You know, these are gorgeous plants. We've seen them throughout the whole season here. We have plenty of these beautiful three gallons, two gallons, and one gallon. Well, we've seen on one of my earlier dock videos, you know, the buddleia still look great. You know, it is getting close to the end of October here. So, I mean, they're pretty much finishing their bloom cycle, but these are big, beautiful plants. Next up here, we're looking at uh, Spirea, double play doozy. Big, heavy, full three guys. So we've seen them on the carts here, and you can see they're a very popular plant. Here again, we're looking at that new gen series. Look at the consistency in the crop. We have some threes here coming down, gorgeous gallons. Here's another plant that's uh, very popular this time of the year, is Guya Fire Chief. Nice color, right? Great landscape plant and color plant. Here we're looking at two gallon mop cypress. We'll see some trees later on in the video, but these trees are a good guys. Provide is another popular plant here. We have some 15 gallon green giants, 15 gallon emerald greens. You know, we have multiple sizes in Arborvitae. These 15s and 25s have been real popular getting those landscapes done. The color plant is Itea. Here we're looking at Itea, Little Henry. You know, this is a three season plant. We're seeing a fall color come in. If you have a tight space garden, this gives you this great red fall color. In the spring, it has beautiful white flowers. Beautiful plants here, guys. I see a little heaven. Looking at three gallon, bright yellow color on Thea Forever Gold. Another very popular plant, great landscape plant by Vernon Pragonon. This is in those five, seven gallon sizes. Big, heavy, full plant. Guys are loading up some hellebores. We see the beautiful lavender coming up. And on the cart there, we're looking at the uh, hydrangea little lion. Grasses are hot everywhere. Here we're looking at the beautiful grasses. And uh, down at the bottom there, azaleas. We'll see some more of those later. And then again, Fuja. This is emerald green arborvitae in a seven gallon. Best ones here, we have our seven gallon camisepris up to Container trees, the guys are digging evergreens and deciduous in the field so be sure to get your field orders in here we're looking at two gallon tater tots and again those azaleas look great and then the three gallon mr bowling ball beautiful crops looking at some ferns we have a fresh crop of ferns getting ready for spring and fall nice full plants there and again still has some gorgeous heuchera available great fall color here we're looking at some holly this is our three gallon blue maize Again, you can see the berries down in there. They haven't turned red just yet, but they still have gorgeous berries. They have great selection of hollow there. Just gonna give you a peek here. This is a, a chameleon blue stem grass. I'll show you that crop later in Huron. Here we're looking at our three gallon blue princess. And we also have the royal family with male, female in the pot. Again, those are starting to color up nice. Here we have Ilex Cronita. This is drops of gold. Nice full plants here, great color. This one is uh, Thuja globosa aurea. Again, folks getting in that fall color. This is a great plant for all season long in the landscape. Nice, consistent crop here. Hackenaloa all gold. You know, those are uh, going into their fall color. But man, these are rooted. They look good. Be great to get them planted. Great size on these three gallon. This is Syringa Bloomerang Dark Purple. A close up on our uh, seven gallon. This is Buxus Green Velvet. Peek at those two gallon uh, tater tots there. And again, the uh, Bernera, fresh crop for spring, but hey, they're shipping now. A peek at our uh, seven gallon grow bags. This is uh, Skyrocket Juniper. We also have some tailors ready. And uh, these are grown in root bags in the field. We put them in these containers for you for shipping. Nice landscape plants. We have the royal family, and these are in uh, the five, seven gallon sizes. Again, beautiful big plants starting to bury up. Beautiful holly, guys. Tied up, but I think you can see the value on these 20 gallon. These are Amelanchier Autumn Brilliance. We also have some beautiful field specimens out there we're digging now. Amelanchier is a very popular landscape plant. 
Well, you can see folks are getting those jobs ready to go. We have some beautiful blue rug junipers coming down here. This is a three gallon hamlin grass all pruned up looking good. And coming down, we see some pears. Those are uh, Katsura, I believe. And then again, seven gallon viburnum summer snowflake. Nice. Doc spilling out to the back door here. We're looking at some Eucharas. Again, looking good. Coreopsis. Nice size plants, guys. If you're getting uh, landscape jobs done, these perennials are big, full plants. Those will do great for you. Start them off good. You here, again, they're starting to get into the fall uh, foliage here, but we're looking at our two gallon Magella. This is a blooming easy electric love. Lots of trees on the dock again. Be sure to get your field orders in. The guys are digging in the field, getting those out. Both uh, evergreen and deciduous are starting to go now. So, you know, get them in. Also kind of looking down here. Look at this gorgeous uh, display of landscape size boxwood. We've seen the new gens and threes, which are big and heavy. We have winter gems, green velvets, beautiful plants here. You know, the knockout roses, as we see here, trim tight, full plants. All the varieties of roses are looking good. Seven gallon maples are a real value, man. They're nice, big, heavy plants. Look at these 25 gallon green giants. Holy smokes, those are gorgeous 84 inch big full plants if you're looking for plants you can't find them in the field i've got them in containers these 25s are landscape red again these fire chiefs are looking amazing look at that nice savvy size great fall color on these guys look at the consistency on them again we're looking at the one gallon of gems and then here we're looking at our uh, pjm elites all butted up getting ready to go for spring Look at these cute plants. This is Firelight Tidbit. You know, a tighter, more compact plant. Dwarf. Beautiful, tight, full plants as you can see here. Looking good. You know, the guys kept them trimmed. We got great branching on them. Again, these are nice, big, full, three gallon Firelight Tidbits. Well, we've seen a lot of uh, paniculatas, and here's some macrophyllas. This is Summer Crush. You know, we have them in the houses. The foliage is looking good for this time of the year because they've been in the houses and they haven't had that hit of cold yet. So, looking good here. Summer crush, three gallons. Another new Arborvitae on the market. Here is a, a new one. This is uh, Thuya Emerald Squeeze in a three gallon. Sunshine this morning on the dock, but I want to give you a glimpse of some of our seven gallon fruit trees. Beautiful crop coming on for fall and spring. Again, these are big, heavy, full plants. Good value. Check out our seven gallon fruit trees. So here we're looking at uh, some beautiful limelight hydrangeas. And then in the background there, look at those. Those are uh, 25 gallon Parkland pillars. And then here we have some 15 gallon Parkland pillars. And then going over here, 25 gallon malice. I mean, beautiful, big, heavy trees. We got inch and three quarter, two inch to 25 gallon. Here we got ficus brown turkey you know this is hardy fig and uh you know you would think this is this is a kind of cool plant if you want something interesting for your yard i'm going to go in here look at that wouldn't that be cool to have in your backyard ficus brown turkey another great price point the uh green giants these are seven gallons so we got sevens 15s 25s many varieties great landscape plants. Well, that's a quick walk through the Avon docks. I'm going to try to get out the Huron here in a little bit, give you a peek at those docks. Here we're looking at some beautiful seven gallon hydrangea trees. Again, we got a lot of hydrangea trees ready to ship. Be sure to go to the sales team. Geez, I hope we're holding the for you. I'm just outside the dock here. Wow, look at all these gorgeous grasses coming in. A lot of nice Carl Forrester and Blonde Ambition. And here we're looking at some Bobosa Aurea. Gorgeous landscape, great plants. More plants coming up here. We're looking at our three gallon nest spruce. Those are beautiful. Ivory halos are looking great. And more of those five gallon. These are green velvets. Next up here, we're looking at double blade doozy. You know, again, we've had a little cool weather here, but they're still looking fantastic. And then a lot of these great looking uh, three gallon dents of That's an exceptional guy. 
Ooh, a great size on this three gallon Miscanthus. Pyrea coming up here. We're looking at more Blackhawks. Beautiful. Hamlins have been looking fantastic. You know, the plumes are holding on there. They're looking good. Some variegated Miscanthus. We see some Cheyenne Sky in the background there. And then here we're looking at Limelight. Nice size on the uh, Stellas here. And a heck of a low grass. Again, it's starting to shut down, but if they're rooted up, they're going to be fantastic for landscape. That green color on the variety again. This is silvery sunproof. And coming over here, holy smokes! Look at these blue Pacific junipers. These are three gallon guys. Nice. So we have some three gallon. These are quick fire. Nice size of those. In the background there, we're looking at Bobo. Looking good. And again, grasses are hot on the dock out here today. See a lot of these on the dock right now. Again, burning bushes, hot starting to color up in the yards. Everybody wants some of them in their yard. And so we're gonna plant over here. You can see nice consistency in the block. Here we have some Physocarpus Little Devil. Again, great fall color. Boy, the guys are busy here. I'm running to catch up to them. Here we have some seven gallon Texas Hicks High. Tell me that's not a good value. Handling grass there. Again, more of the Physocarpus Little Devil. Nice size plants, good shape to them and color. Carl Forrester's hot on the dock as well. Beautiful twos and twos. You can see the team's at it today. Here we're looking at some three gallon quick fire. Beautiful plants there again. Nice color to the flower at this time of the year. You can see they're still loading these Carl Foresters. Three gallon mop cypress. Nice over here. Again, you see the nice color and consistency to the crop. Beautiful. See here, loading up those pinky winkies along with these mob cypress. Again, the guys are busy this time, he's jumping there. More of the variegated miscanthus and bobos. The hicks are going great. I mean, those seven gallons are exceptional value there. And again, bobo right now is looking really good. More plants coming up to the dock here. These are little foot fires. Nice plants. Yeah, here we have some uh, three gallon sky pencils and uh, this one is Aronia Low Skate Mound. I mean, if you're looking for a great plant, this is uh, very resilient, great ball color. You've seen this one on the dock last week. This is uh, Hydrangea Little Hottie. And uh, you can see here the buds on them are just amazing. This thing performs very well all season long. It was a blooming machine, Little Hottie. Now we grow a lot of different Deravilla, and this one here has uh, an amazing Deravilla from first positions. This is cool splash. You can see the nice variegation stands out very well in the landscape. Deravilla cool splash. Three gallon pinky winky. You can see the, the blooms are turning that nice uh, red color for fall. Beautiful three gallon pinky winky. Stopped in one of our grass sections here to show you a little more of the grasses. Here we're looking at three gallon. These are Cheyenne Sky. Yeah, it's really hard to beat these big three gallon. These are Penicetum Hamlins. Plumed up, they are looking great. Check out these Miscanthus Chrysalis, man. They are looking good. Nice big heavy plants, plumed up. There they go. So here we have uh, some of the new grasses in the Worry Free program. And this one is Cayenne. And uh, this is a two gallon grass here. It has interesting, a little bit darker plumes. So these are all Penicetum type. They're gonna stay short, tight, and compact for you. These are non-invasive and uh, very interesting. So this one is Cayenne. Here we have Jambalaya. Again, this one has a little lighter plume to it. Um, very lacy texture. Penicetum type again, gonna stay short and compact for you. Non-invasive Jambalaya. Up here in the Worry Free, we have Praline. Again, a lot of uh, shorter type Penicetum grass, tight compact habit. This one is Praline. Smaller grass that I want to show you is this is uh, Carex Everest. And uh, you can see here these gorgeous grasses are canned up early. This has got a nice fine texture to it. It's variegated uh, green and white. Hardy grass, they're looking good. Obviously, this is our spring crops, but hey, they're ready to go now if you're looking for some plants to finish the job. Here except. Here's another one. This is uh, Everline. Again, this is a slightly different variegation to it. It's dark green in the 
center light green to the edge. Purex Everline. Just had to stop and show you these three gallon blue stars. Look at the size and grade, guys. These are three gallons. We got plenty of nice, big, heavy plants here for you for your landscape jobs. Three gallon blue stars. Here's another one, and we do uh, quite a few of these because they're very popular azaleas. Here we're looking at azalea, Kieran, and a three gallon. Man, look at the size and grade on these plants, guys. They're ready to go. Three gallon Kieran. Well, again, here's another showstopper. This is chameleon blue stem grass. You can see how it comes into this fall color and hues of pinks and burgundies. Gorgeous grass here, guys. During the summer, it's green and white variegation. Again, this is a beautiful plant. These are in high demand. As you can see, we've got them canned up and ready to go for spring or fall. Another great plant for your fall land and spring landscapes is our seven gallon Heads columnaris. You can see these got great size to them, exceptional value. That's Columnaris, seven guys. Here we go again. The guys have been busy filling this morning. This is going up to the dock now. You know, we're continually filling it back up. People getting the jobs done this fall. Our distribution centers are loaded. Docks are going out. We're ready for your fall projects. 